Good morning, and welcome back to Daily Dhamma, a letter to our children. Today is May 23rd, and our reading is Via Negativa. In the Christian tradition, Via Negativa is used to describe God in terms of what God is not, rather than by defining God's characteristics affirmatively. It has much older roots, however. God is not hatred, nor fear, anger, resentment, self-pity, or envy. The Buddha described God, transcendent reality, in similes and metaphors because language is utterly inadequate. We often hear a God of our understanding, and we say that sometimes too, but it's just as accurate to say a God of our total misunderstanding. What kind of a deity would it be if I could describe it to you? I couldn't pick God out of a lineup if I had to. But we see the operation of God in our lives. When God is in our life, things go one way. And when God is not in our life, things go a completely different way. And if the term God upsets you, try Gus or, or good orderly direction or grace over drama or any of a number of other formulations that are a little more avuncular and happy sounding. Again, we're not telling anybody what to believe. We're describing what we believe and what acts in our life. There is a real difference depending on whether or not we are humble and put God and others before ourselves, or if we live in a self-centered, will-driven existence. One of these things is not like the other. Please take a look at the description box and you will find the table of contents for the book, Daily Dhamma, A Letter to Our Children. You'll also see playlists for this YouTube broadcast, and you can take a look at what's contained in them. We highly recommend them. If you're of a mind, please like and subscribe to the channel. And if you wouldn't mind dropping by Amazon and picking up a, a book there, it's available in kindle and paperback form and happy trails to you until we meet again